What's up everybody? My name is Jaspreet Singh and welcome to the Minority Mindset. You guys already know, I say what needs to be said to get to the point. I don't try to sugarcoat things. So today, I want to talk about something I cannot stand. I'm going to lay this on the table right now. Life is not fair. Some of us have to work harder than others to get the exact same thing. So you can do one of two things. You can complain and cry about how it's unfair. Or you can say, alright, screw it, I'll do whatever it takes to get it done, even if that means working harder. Whatever your excuse is, somebody has already overcome it. Grew up poor with no opportunity and no hope, so did Oprah. She grew up so poor that she used to wear potato sacks as dresses. She was raped for the first time when she was nine. When she was 14, she was molested by her cousin, uncle, and became pregnant, so she ran away from home because no one supported her and that led to a miscarriage. Now, she's worth 2.9 billion dollars. Don't have enough money to start a business? Hewlett Packard HP started with $538 in startup capital. Now they're worth 56 billion. Business not going so well? Coca-Cola only sold 25 bottles of Coke their first year of operation. Now 1.8 billion Coca-Cola products are consumed a day. My parents didn't support me. My friends told me I was stupid. I had no startup capital. I had no experience and I had no knowledge. Been there, done that. Excuses make you weak. For the last few days, I've been sick with a runny nose and sore throat, and everybody's been telling me to take a day off. Listen, I'm not gonna die from having a little cold. Stop making excuses. The world's not gonna stop just because you don't feel good. Stop wasting time making excuses, and stop wasting everyone else's time complaining about your excuses. That's not the minority mindset. That's a horrible mindset. Try this. Try to go 21 days without making a single excuse or a single complaint. When you stop verbalizing your excuses, you change the way you think and that eventually will change your mindset. Yeah, if something's really wrong or if you're really sick, get it checked out. Don't be stupid either. Every single person on this earth faces adversity and we all only have one life to live. Our time is limited. Don't throw it away feeling bad for yourself. I know this was a harsh video, but there's no other way for me to explain it. Surround yourself with positive vibes and positive people and things that can keep motivating you so you can stay focused and keep going even when you don't feel like it. And really quick, starting in two days, Minority Mindset is starting another takeover month. I have a lot of really cool content coming your way, so get ready. And if you want to learn about how you can get your money working for you, I wrote an ebook on investing. It's completely free and you can download it on my website by clicking this link right here. And be sure to subscribe to the Minority Mindset YouTube channel because we're coming out with new videos on business and entrepreneurship every single week. And share this with your friends on Facebook so they can learn too. Follow me on Snapchat for daily entrepreneurship and business tips. Take a picture or screenshot of this image right here. Go to Snapchat, click add friends, add my snap code, it's like this image. And I'm doing my last scheduled Periscope this Saturday at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So I'll see you there. And as always, keep hustling.